As quoted by the World Health Organization, coronavirus disease, COVID-19, is an infectious disease caused by a newly discovered coronavirus. This newly discovered disease is forcing many to stay home in fear of catching the disease, as about one in every five people who catch it need hospital care. COVID-19 has caused many local businesses to shut down if they are not deemed essential. As convenience store owners, Hong Tran and Hong Win must continue to work. They first immigrated to America when they were teenagers. Hong was about 13 when he first came and Hong was about 19. They are both very poor in Vietnam with nothing and seek to better life. After meeting in America and with the help and support of many people, families and churches, they are able to start their small convenience store together. After over eight years, they still continue to provide great customer service and help local residents get what they need. How important is your business to the local residents in this area? Um, I think it's important because the people behind us, they don't have a car, so they walk to us. They count on us to be open so they can get their grocery. And that's my responsible to be here. I have to go shop in the stores because they limit everything now. So some items I cannot get to try to find the stuff for my customer. Are there any local businesses that have shut down and why? I see one of the gas stations, they close because they put the size up. They say the reason is the coronavirus. What does being essential mean to you? Essential mean to me is, I think it's like something people need. They gotta have it. It's important for their life and I'm so glad to be a part of the work that can help people get their normal living in the hard times like this. From 8 a.m. to 8 p.m., Monday through Saturday, Country Corner runs and operates with two employees, the business owners. From knowing no English to successfully filling out governmental documents for their business, they had to overcome many challenges. How has the pandemic affected your family? I uh, want to see my mom. It's, it's really hard because uh, we can't hug, we can't see each other. Um, I came to see my mom, drop some stuff on my mom, but I have to see her from distance. I tell her, mom, come out so I can see you. So um, it's really hard. And my son's and stay in the room. Uh, and he cannot go to school and he said, Mommy, I want to go back to school. I have a daughter, so she's a flight attendant. Um, she had to work with travel load, so it's really hard. I was worried, uh, but right now they give her some time off. My brother, he's a pilot uh, in Italy. He have a family there with three little children. He's still working and he work from home sometime. And have another brother, he's a doctor, ER doctor. It's really tough, but I'm glad they can serve and help other people. Everybody can, you know, just be hanging there, try to do the best we can. As an Asian American business owner, have you faced any racism? Customer is very nice to us. They know where we come from, but once in a while, I have some customer from our town and they just stop by and they just have a question, say, where you come from? And I just say, I come from Vietnam. We just like a small family in here, it's in a small town and they're very supportive. Lots of people of different backgrounds come through the doors every day, six days a week. With that are lots of germs and exposures to airborne illnesses. To combat the spread, there are many things that are recommended by the yeah. CDC like cleaning your hands often, avoiding close contact, curving your face when around others, and disinfecting daily. What precautions do you take as your business remains open? It's very important to sanitize my store. I wear gloves, and I have a protection on the, the clear shield glass. Don't have to get direct contact with customers, same as they don't get direct contact with me. And I bring vitamin C every day, try to keep myself healthy for my family as for my customer. As a running business, these precautions must be adhered to to keep everyone safe. The convenience store sells many things, almost anything that you need. Very important to me because I like the owners. They are very nice and always respectable. And I also like it here because they have most of everything I need. For many local residents, this business is the only option they have as they don't have the means of transportation to go to bigger grocery stores. Workers always have to be cautious more so than anyone else. Facing the disease at high risks every day 
is something that has to be done. To provide for their families, it's a blessing to stay open as many don't have the luxury. The pressure to not get infected, not spread it to your family, and to stay open to help provide food and other items is on the shoulders of essential workers. It's still an uneasy job, but for those in need, it's necessary and essential. Can't turn on. <laughs> it's my car. My broken car.